When the item is selected, to add the modifier item, we need to click on the selected item from the selected items list. When the item is clicked here it will redirect us to the order tag page. To select the modifiers immediately after selecting the item, some setting has to be modified at the back office. Let us see how this is done. Navigate to back office. Under products. Select menu list. Here from the list. Click on the required category and click edit product properties. This page with menu item properties opens up. Here, enable the auto select property for the products we need to display modifiers automatically. Let us enable it for all the items for this category. Also, we can create any default modifiers for any of the items on this page. For example, let us configure the add-on item mayonnaise as a default modifier for crispy fish. Under the order tag column, add the default modifier name like this and save. To add multiple default modifier, just add the names as comma separated values. Now let us go to the order page and check all the settings we made here. Now if we click any of the starter items, you can see we are automatically redirected to the modifiers page. You can see this is not the case with other category items. This requires us to click on the item for modifiers to be visible. Hence by enabling auto select for required items, we can eliminate the need of clicking on the selected item for the modifiers to be visible. Also, let us check the default modifier we created for the crispy fish item. When we choose the crispy fish item, you can see the modifier is added automatically. We did not have to add this manually. This way we can add any default add-ons if required.